your skin is as important as what's in your body. This movement, though, is fueled by ingredients in our products, which, as you know, has been our mission for 38 years. We are launching what we're calling tonight our Not Allowed List. I guess that was really this morning, not tonight. So this morning. So more than 2,000 ingredients make up what we're calling our Not Allowed List. 1,400, which actually come from the European Union, and then more than 600 on top of that, that we absolutely will not waver and will not formulate with. In all of our categories. And this directly ref reflects all of Arbonne's rigorous screening, safety testing, research, and everything that we believe absolutely makes a difference. We're gonna launch all of this on the website in the next couple of weeks in all of our countries. So we're gonna give you a snapshot tonight or today, but you'll absolutely get this full visibility to everyone in the world because we really want everyone to see this loud and clear. Our not allowed list is defined by four clear buckets. And you've been asking for that. Like how do we decide what we formulate with or without? So here's the four buckets. The first is ingredients have to be mission aligned. That means they're vegan, gluten-free, non-GMO, no artificial flavors, colors. We do not test on animals. They are not allowed in our products. <laughs> safety, so safety. Ingredients that have high levels of irritation, toxicity, a high allergen content, right? known hormone disruptors, cancer-causing, or have negative consumer press. Those are not allowed in our products. Third, legislation. And this one's a really important one. So clearly we follow all of the uh, regulatory uh, allowances because uh, we're compliant obviously in all of our countries but we're also really good at keeping an ear to the ground as to what's coming a couple of years down the road and for that reason ingredients that we know are potentially questionable they are not allowed in our products and last but not least our green commitment, environmental, ingredients that are harmful to the environment and have a negative impact on communities are not allowed. So we're really proud of that. Secondly, we're creating a campaign that we're gonna push out there in social media and we're gonna send the message to the world that Arbonne, we've established this. We've